Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Skywall Show. So, this, as you can see in the title, I couldn't hold it any longer. I need to do it. This is gonna be a rant on Johnny Cage, Mortal Kombat 11. And you might ask yourself, why are you ranting now? Or the same, why are you crying now? Because this whole video is gonna be me crying. Don't miss, don't, I don't wanna be mistaken. This is gonna be me complaining and crying. That, that's everything this video is gonna be. If you're not interested, please get out of the video right now. Um, why now? Well, yeah, they revealed the third variation of Johnny Cage. I'm so disappointed and I just thought about everything that's wrong with this character and I want to express it, get it out of the way. So I'm sorry, developers, if I sound a little rude in this video. I might. I'm angry. Um, this is also for comedic purposes, so don't be offended. But, but yeah, let's see why Johnny Cage fucking sucks in a lot of aspects. Not all of them. Be warned. Not everything is bad. But a lot of stuff is. So, let's first start by the good thing. Johnny Cage is uh, not a terrible character, by any means, okay? He has really good tools, and I really like the job that they did with his animations, his visual aspect, uh, his lines, everything about him. Footsie's bait design that he has, super fast move speed that he has, fast buttons, fast reaching buttons. Um, it is all super fun, okay? And the way he moves and expresses and everything, it's a really big improvement on Mortal Kombat uh, 10 Johnny Cage. So congrats to the developers, that's super fun. But uh, having get, uh, I have more stuff to say, good stuff to say about Johnny Cage, but this is everything I'm gonna say right now because this is a rant. Damn, I'm good. So the elephant in the room, the burden of every Johnny Cage players. Females. I don't know if this is a bad, a bad joke of bad taste or something, but why is Johnny Cage down to tears when he plays against females? Gonna get caged! So, which is the point of this move again? Like, normally with a uh, string has two follow-ups, you can mix it up or something, but they just have to crouch block, and they block both of them. If this was an overhead, well, then maybe you could do this and uh, get plus frames, but even then, how would you hit it? Have a really good look at it, because you're never gonna see it in a real match. Three hundred damage. It's harder to do. Oh, it can. It, it should be a lot of damage, right? Three hundred eleven damage. Cool, cool, cool. Real cool. Super useful crushing blow. Thank you very much. And the award goes to. Okay, let's get to the good stuff, right? Let's get to the mind parry. Woohoo! This move is kind of useful, you can use it at the end of some strings if they are trying to poke or whatever. Although they can also use the low and it will beat it. Um, you can use it to bait wake up attacks. It's not completely worthless. It gives you a combo for 1 meter which is acceptable. Uh, crushing blow requirements sucks though. So I don't know about this move. So fisticuffs, hey, actually a good move. It would be really nice to be able to hit force ball afterwards. Like as a cheap damage if it didn't whiff on females, but hey, at least I get, I don't know, more damage and I get more cheap damage, which is kind of good, I guess, yeah, nice. Haha, <laughs> I have my fisticuffs up, Tiff. Now it's time for you to die with my fisticuffs. Oh, oh wait, oh it's true, there's no fisticuffs in this variation. Well, I will guess I'll settle for Cage Rage, which is not a terrible move, to be honest, but eh, it's super situational. And if you are paying attention, you can just crouch it and punish it most of the time. Although this is a guaranteed setup, so... Meh. Meh. Showstopper from zero to hero, am I right? Well, the camera moves, it's kind of good now. You get some unblockable damage. But um, the glasses move, it bothers me so much. Now people is like flipping out because you can... Oh my god, the crushing blow, it's so much easier to get now. And you get... Uh, a restance and a real combo and what the fuck guys is a whole fucking slot and this is a useless move but for the crushing blow it's a meme it's a fucking meme of a move it's it's not even a mid projectile like it, it bounces off your opponent and it's and it's it has tons of recovery and tons of startup in, in and it does and it's only useful when you have once per match when you have your fatal blow and you are able to do a dash cancel. It's like the worst fucking move ever. And it's a whole slot that you it's wasted there. Should be included with the camera or something and give him another move, right? Oh my god, third variation. Look guys, it's Johnny Cage from MK2. Oh, oh 
it's super cool. Oh yeah, look at him go. Mmm, yeah. Mmm, this variation is so good. But they have fixed the both first boss weaving. Yeah, thank you very much, but until now it has been shit. Why why did it come out like this? Didn't did they just not test it? Come on, it's more likely not to hit. Which is the point? Which is the fucking point of this move? This is kind of good though. This is this is actually one of the only good custom moves that Johnny Cage has, for real. All the other custom moves kind of suck. And why is this two fucking slots? Two slots? What the fuck? It's the same fucking thing! And it, in, and it occupies two slots! And it's shit, it's, it's f far worse than the normal one! What, what, what in the, what they, what were they thinking? So I was actually going to rant about this, how bad this variation was, but I made the mistake of trying it. And I realized it's super fun. It's super fun. I don't know if it will be good competitively, but damn, is it fun to get your assholes out, you know, and, and just Showtime. beating the shit out of your opponent with with your assholes out. I don't know, man. And also this move, it's I thought it was bad, but it's pretty useful. It does a lot of damage. It's a really, really good combo in there, and I'm sure it's useful for more stuff. But but man, now I'm even more sad because they didn't give him this variation, they give him the Mortal Kombat 2 variation which is super boring so yeah that's the whole point of the video just getting my rage out guys letting you know what are the bad things that Johnny Cage has it's not all bad he's a pretty good character in my opinion especially when he's not up against females as we have discussed but but yeah that's it that's the end of the video thank you for watching guys my rant about Johnny Cage I hope I wasn't much of a cray baby but yeah see you next time